Rescaling light fields to different resolutions and aspect ratios is challenging. As for regular image and video content, a linear scaling alters the aspect ratio of recorded objects in an unnatural way. In contrast, image and video retargeting utilizes a nonlinear and content based scaling. Applying image retargeting to individual video frames independently does not retain temporal consistency. Similarly, applying image retargeting naively to the spatial domain of light fields will not retain angular consistency. We present the first approach to light field retargeting. It allows compressing or stretching light fields while retaining angular consistency. In the following, we present our processing pipeline and initial results. For retargeting a light field, we first convert it into a focal stack by rendering its focal slices from the central perspective with correspondingly adjusted focal length. We apply seam carving to the central perspective. The seams are derived from an energy map based on the L1 norm of the gradients with forward energy calculation. Since the central perspective matches the perspective of the focal stack, we can remove the same calculated seams in all of its slices without violating angular consistency. Removing pixels where the seams are cutting through out of focus regions in slices of the focal stack, however, causes deconvolution errors around edges during the reconstruction of the light field perspectives. Therefore, we avoid cutting seams through these critical regions. They are determined by integrating the RGB differences between all focal stack slices and the deconvolved central perspective. This integral is used as an additional energy term for seam carving. The new energy term improves our results, but cannot completely avoid critical seams. Therefore, remaining artifacts are attenuated by convolving the focal stack slices in regions with new gradients that are created by seam carving. New gradients in each focal slice are determined by comparing two corresponding gradient maps. One is computed from the retargeted focal stack slice, and the other one is computed by retargeting the gradient map of the original focal stack slice. The individual focal slices are then convolved in regions where these gradient maps differ. We assume that background objects are visually less salient. Therefore, we penalize seams through foreground objects to better preserve them. This is achieved by reconstructing a coarse depth map from the focal stack, which is used as a third energy term for seam carving. All three energy terms lead to the final seams that are used for carving. The retargeted focal stack can be converted back to a light field by shifting and averaging its slices according to the desired perspective and by deconvolving the resulting image with the perspective dependent point spread function. With increasing sensor resolutions of digital cameras, light field imaging is becoming more and more relevant and might even replace classical 2D imaging in photography sooner or later. To our knowledge, we presented the first approach to light field retargeting. It enables stretching and compressing light fields while preserving the angular consistency without the need for reconstructing precise depth information. The conversion of focal stacks to light fields and back leads to imperfect reconstructions at occlusion boundaries and to a slight cropping at the borders. In future, we want to investigate more advanced techniques for filtering critical seams.